What's going on everyone? Sean here from Krypton Cause Investing and today we're going to be talking about Jungni, the Matic Cat. Now this is one of those tokens where unfortunately the dev abandoned it. It went all the way up to about 1.6 million and then dropped down to about 50k which is where the dev abandoned. Now fortunately community members and some admins got together and grinded all the way back to that 1 million market cap which is very impressive. Now we do see devs doing this all the time. They make their money or whatever it is. I don't know the exact backstory with this, but they make their money and then they leave. And then the community will come together, maybe some admins, and then really get to work. You know, because you all kind of have that common goal that you've been burnt and you really just want to get together and make this the best token pos possible. And a lot of times that's how the best communities are built. And that looks to be the case for Jungni. But let's go ahead and hop on over to the website and see what it's all about. All right, so here we are on the website jungnipolygon.com and we have the inspirational Jungni story. Born on a rainy night in a godless city, a nameless and neglected stray kitten wandered the streets in search of a family. Life wasn't kind. Hunger and desperation led the young cat astray, joining a notorious gang. But fate intervened when the cat stumbled upon the awe-aspiring Matic Villa. The technology haven of the Polygon team, seeing potential in his lost soul, the compassionate team took the cat in, showering it with with care and affection. They named it Jungni, Punjabi for the spirit of life, essence of life. In Punjabi culture, Jungni refers to a female spirit, a folklore that is often depicted as a wandering soul. So they kind of were taken in by the Polygon CEO. Jungni has been welcomed and interacted with on socials by Polygon CEO and co-founder and Polygon Labs CEO. It's safe to say meme culture is coming to Polygon and they're all in. So we kind of have our stray cat that has been taken in by the Polygon CEO. Now they do have some utility. They have the Jungni Swap. You can trade it using Jungni Swap, a personalized DEX with a 0.2% transaction going back to the community marketing wallet, which is very, very important. Now this is a 0% tax token, which is gonna make it super tradable. Usually when tax tokens are 0%, you're gonna have more trading volume than you know those high tax tokens that are like 10, 15% because you can obviously get in and out with a lower margin of percent up to make that profit. So it's very important to find ways to send money to that market in a while. Whether you wanna develop more stuff or just flat out market, you need funds. And again, with a zero tax token, that's impossible to get. So that's good that they already have this working utility. So the market in a wallet is also on a six person Genos multi-sig with four approval required for any transactions. So all those funds will be sent to that Genos multi-sig and they will need four of the six to approve it. So no one has direct access so that money, which is always a good thing, you can join their Telegram here. Now, I'm going to have everything you need to know linked in the description down below, website, Telegram, Twitter, all that good stuff. Now, we do have the Jungni NFT collection coming soon. So Jungni's outrageous story has inspired her first NFT collection, showcasing her journey from stray to thug to Matic Villa royalty. But Jungni's journey has only just begun in this upcoming NFT collection, which is the first to drop in a series, also offers a rare NFT glimpse into her bright future. So we have all of our contact information right here, but we are gonna hop on over to the socials like Twitter, check out some of the tweets, see what they've recently had going on, and we're gonna hop on over to the chart and just take a look at some of those numbers and see exactly how they've been doing. All right, so here we are on their Twitter. Go ahead and give them a follow. As I said, it will be linked in the description down below. I already have 1,809 followers. Come on down, let's see what some of the tweets about. So we had a caller right here, caught at 300K, then at 180, and today it reaches all time high. Jungni is here to stay, so total market cap right here, 1.47 million. Liquidity, 123,000. Very, very solid. We will look and see how current this is, though, in one minute. Come on down, live view of Jungni right now. This insane momentum deserves this meme of course we got to include elon musk the mission to the moon is starting for jungni this was 11 hours ago buckle up the matic cat is not stopping anytime soon distribution of holders in liquidity pool is impeccable which i agree with that supply near four percent with burn wallet at five percent enjoy enjoy the cat overtaking the dogs which love to see that kind of getting tired of the whole dog thing from dogecoin to shiba inu might as well see some cats coming in there and taking over which they kind of are the king of the memes then we have brace yourself the jungni storm is coming and soon everyone in crypto will know the name jungni is the matic 
cat, 5% of the supply is burnt, liquidity is burnt, and contract is renounced with 0% tax, which again, 0% tax always makes it super tradable, usually leads to a lot of volume. But as you can see, their tweets and their Twitter are very, very active. All of those tweets I've just read were basically tweeted within the last 24 hours. So it's always good to see the communities engaged. Like I said, guys, when devs leave projects, a lot of times the communities will rally behind it. And they really can and really do turn it into something special. In my three years in DeFi, I've seen it count happen more times than I can count, along with me being a part of some of those movements over the course of the years of really bringing a project up after a dev left. But let's go ahead, hop on over to that chart and just kind of see what the liquidity looks like, see what the market cap looks like and all that good stuff. Lastly, let's go ahead and look at the chart. Now, people that follow the channel know that I don't really subscribe to technical analysis and things like that, but I do like reading the numbers and see what's going on. It's trading at a penny and a half, basically. We have a total market cap of 1.40. Remember and think about how impressive that is. When the dev left it, they were at 50K and they've clawed their way all the way back up to 1.4 million, which is very solid and very impressive. Liquidity, 118K also very solid 1.49 K holders. So not even a 2000 holders yet haven't been released on any centralized exchanges or anything. So big things are going to be coming for this project. Last 24 hours, they've done $126,000 in volume, 99.57 K total transactions. So near that hundred thousand. So they are definitely, definitely very, very active. Again, solid market cap, solid liquidity. Everything about this project looks to be very, very good. Remember guys, this is never financial advice. Everything I'm telling you is just my opinion. I'm introducing you to this project. Go ahead and click all the links below from the Telegram to the website to the Twitter and go ahead and see that if it's something that you might be interested in joining up with. If it is, that's awesome. But that will do it for this video. And until next time, trade safe.